What's going on guys, Twin coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 video. Today is the day that we're starting our grind for 99 Chipper Jones. I have not played a ranked seasons game in forever. We need to make World Series. At the time you guys are seeing this video, there's probably 9 days left in the season. The time of recording this, there's 10 days left. So I really need to get going and make World Series so that I can get Chipper Jones. I've only played one game. We're 1-0 to start the season. We really want to go 2-0, win this game here today. And I just want to say real quick as well before we hop into this game i'm still a little bit sick i'm still not feeling great i've been losing like just overall i just i have been feeling really out of it on youtube for the uh the past week or two and i'm hoping today is kind of like a bounce back day i think my sickness is definitely affecting me though it's like i, I don't want to do anything uh, I, I would like to just like sleep all the time and everything ever since I've been sick and I'm hoping I start feeling better soon I'm definitely feeling better than I have in the past few days, but still not 100% So I'm sorry about that, but I'm still trying to do these daily uploads for you guys and My bad for just losing maybe not being as hype as anything like that for the last few days or anything But be sure to leave a like subscribe comment follow on any of the social media stuff of the Fortnite channel Thank you so much to our channel members for the extra support. Let's go ahead hop into this game This is the team that I'm using. It's the team that I started the season off with so I'm not making any changes We got to get this win today be 2-0 to start the season get closer to chipper jones we're playing the chicago bombers our opponent has 97 jose reyes 99 alomar gwen mays garrick 95 nick castellanos and right 99 josh donaldson tom siever on the mound for both of us let's go he's making his debut today i'm excited 96 jason kendall and this is an all-star difficulty game guys i will mention that but tom siever's making his debut for us here today i'm excited to use him and also face him Jose Reyes, the first batter that I face, giving up a base hit. In the comment section below, if you guys have used and or faced Tom Seaver, the signature series version here, and it will be 19, what do you think of him? Do you like him? Do you think he's easy to pick up, not easy to pick up, stuff like that? Let me know your thoughts down in that comment section. I hit in the top of the first inning. I guess I didn't hit. I mean, like, I, I was batting, but I had a 1, 2, 3 top of the first inning. Not a great inning for me. I'm hoping to get rid of that in the rest of this game and i'm definitely hoping to get out of this inning without allowing anything here facing roberto alomar as i've given up back-to-back -back base hits to start the inning we're in danger of losing already griffey's gonna try to get that one in he's getting it in fast we got him at home easily let's go we got him we got him let's go that's huge that just like that my confidence was shattered when that ball went into the outfield that just brought it right back Wild pitch he's advanced into third i'm tempted to walk tony gwynn so we have a double play in order i think i'm gonna do it I'm going to walk Tony Gwynn. I feel like this might be a stupid decision, but I just I want a ground ball to hopefully give me a double play with Willie Mays up. Willie Mays striking out for a big out number two. Lou Gehrig from 0-2 to 3-2 to flying out, popping out to the catcher for the final on. After one inning at 0-0, that was stressful, though. That was a stressful inning on the mound. Mike Piazza, there we go, my first base hit, top of the second inning, one down. Let's see if we could try to drive him in, maybe get a few hits in a row, something into the gap to score him. Tony Gwynn saw the pitch well, but straight to center field for the second out of the inning. That's going to be bringing up, I actually don't even remember my lineup, that's going to be bringing up Rogers Hornsby right here with two down, facing Tom Seaver. Rogers Hornsby into the outfield. Hanging up, caught by Willie Mays for the final end of the inning. Ken Griffey Jr. I think there were maybe four or five foul balls in the at-bat, and you guys know me. When my opponent's fouling off a lot of pitches, I have a hard time putting him away, and I eventually give him a pitch to hit, and Griffey's getting that leadoff single to start the bottom half of the second. Josh Donaldson, probably no double play. At least we're getting one out, though. Tom Seaver... Second out of the inning. And we're getting Jason Kendall checking his swing, but it's going to be a in, an infield single. Okay. Two on, two down for the leadoff hitter, Jose Reyes. Pitch number 40 incoming here in the bottom of the second with two down. Jose Reyes into the outfield. Going to score one, hopefully not two. And it's only scoring one. We got him at home. That's good. But it's still scored a run. We're losing now. One to nothing after two innings here. Cal Ripken. Single to lead us off here. Top of the third. We really want to try to get that run back. I don't want to be losing anymore. Bunting with Tom Seaver. And it is going to be... 
A good sacrifice bunt from Tom. Robbie Alomar, I was waiting on it. To Willie Mays for the second out of the inning. We're advancing the run, though, or the runner. We're advancing the runner to third. All we need is a single or something, and he's going to score and tie that game one-to-one. -one. Yeah, we squared that one up. I was going to say that one felt pretty good, but just hit it straight to Willie Mays. 3-0 to Frank Thomas, and he decides to intentionally walk him. That brings up 99 Griffey with two on, two down. Griffey popping up. We got a pitch down the middle, and I'm popping out to the catcher. Tony Gwynn. Up the middle, one out base hit here. Bottom of the third inning, 89 speed, sitting on first base. I actually don't, I need to remember who's up. So Willie Mays is coming up to bat, and we're hoping to maybe get him grounded into a double play or something. Willie Mays, back-to-back -back singles, dang, man. Lou Gehrig, double play ball, come on. Maybe one out. No, nobody down, infield single for Lou Gehrig, base is loaded. And Griffey. To the outfield. I hope Griffey can throw the run around. I think it's going to be very tough with 89 speed. We got him. Let's No, we didn't. Oh, I thought we had him. Man. I felt like that throw was there in plenty of time. Shoot. And Josh Donaldson is flying out to end the inning. Still down, though. We're losing now 2 to nothing instead of 1 to nothing after three innings. Willie Mays hit it hard. Straight to Tony Gwynn, though. Four out number one here. Top of the fourth inning. That is going to bring up Mike Piazza with one down. Top of the fourth inning. Mike Piazza to Tony Gwynn. Back-to-back -back line outs straight to the right fielder. That brings up Tony Gwynn with two down here in the top of the fourth inning. Tony Gwynn. Two. Tony Gwynn, man. <laughs> what an inning. Jason Kendall off of the pitcher. And he has the single. One down. Bottom of the fourth inning. Jose Reyes. Little blooper into the outfield. Back-to-back -back singles. Only one down. I definitely don't want to allow any more runs. Roberto Alomar. Probably no double play. We got behind the back. We got one. But no double play there. Just not hit hard enough. That brings up Tony Gwynn. Two on. Two down. And Tony Gwynn grounding out. We're escaping danger. Wow. That's good. I got to start warming guys up. So far, Tom Seaver, I'm having difficulty locating pitches. Now, I feel like I have that issue with every pitcher. So, I don't know if that says anything. And I'm giving up a lot of base hits. So, I don't know how I'm liking Tom Seaver so far. I'm definitely interested to hear what you guys think of him and to try him out hopefully have a few more starts and just kind of see where he's at in a few games. Lou Gehrig down the line. Going to be fair. One out, probably double for Lou Gehrig here, bottom of the fifth inning. Full count to Griffey, and we're getting him to fly out for out number two. I would love to be able to get this guy at third if he goes. He's not going, though. Staying at second. Two down. Josh Donaldson, two-run home run. We're losing four to nothing in the bottom of the fifth inning, man. That sucks. Roberto Alomar leading off the sixth inning. Dang, man. Straight to Tony Gwynn. I've been hitting it to Tony Gwynn quite a bit this game. That's out number one, top of the sixth. The game is slowly coming to an end here. And I think I only have two hits, and we're in the top of the sixth inning. Ken Griffey Jr., Hit it pretty well, just straight to Junior out there for the final line of the sixth inning. Jason Kendall, little blooper into the outfield. That's going to be a leadoff single in the bottom of the sixth inning. So that brings up Jose Reyes. He's three for three today, two switch hitters in a row. I'm just going to take out Tom Seaver. I think it's time to get him out of here. Let's bring in 95 Goose. Jose Reyes grounding into a one-out play, a one-out play. And I need to really, I guess, maybe be doing that. If my opponent's fouling off some pitches, I need to make sure I'm still staying with it and getting him out. Because, like, earlier in the game, I think I gave up a hit or two after having my opponent foul off some. And it's just I really need to keep focusing up and not let him groove something. Roberto Alomar to Willie Mays for out number two. Tony Gwynn to Frank Thomas. Frank Thomas boots it a little bit. But we got the out, final line of the inning. 
Going to the seventh. After six, we're down still. Four to nothing. Do I still only have two hits? I actually want to check this real quick. I still only have two hits and we're in the seventh inning, man. Willie Mays facing Raleigh Fingers. That's going to be a leadoff single. Top of the seventh. Mike Piazza. Don't be a double play. <laughs> the one time I get a runner on, I'm grinding into a double play, man. I can't believe it. Two down here. Top of the seventh inning. That sucks. Tony Gwynn hit it pretty well. Just kidding. Actually, I don't know. Maybe he did hit it well. Tony Gwynn going to have a triple here. Two-out triple for Tony Gwynn. Rogers Hornsby, let's go. I seriously thought we had it into the outfield. Man, that would have scored a run, too. And that's one thing. I wish there was some way to see, like, exit velos and stuff, even on the final line of an inning, because that one seemed like it was scorched, man. That seemed like it was absolutely destroyed to that first baseman. I want to see how hard it was hit. Lou Gehrig up the middle for a one-ounce single. I think we're in the bottom of the seventh, right? I'm pretty sure bottom of the seventh inning here. One runner on, one down. Ken Griffey Jr. Wow. And that's going to drive in a run. We're down five. Josh Donaldson is second two-run homer of the game. And <laughs> this one is quickly getting out of reach. We're down seven to nothing. Cal Ripken Jr. leading us off with a single here. And at the top of the eighth inning, actually it's going to be a double, a double for Cal to lead off the top of the eighth inning. Lou Gehrig, I was right on that one. Come on. No, straight to Willie Mays. Lou Gehrig pinch hitting. And he hits it to Willie Mays for... Out number one. Let's really try to score at least one run in the inning, guys. We got the top of our lineup up now. Alomar coming up. Hit it pretty well with Garrick, just not quite enough, I guess. Roberto Alomar drives in the run. Wow. We actually scored a run. We're not being shut out anymore. Tony Gwynn, two out base hit. Bottom of the eighth inning. I do not want to allow any more runs. I'm already down by six, and I'm down to my final three outs. So I really don't think we can afford any more runs here at all. Willie Mays up the middle. Let's just toss it to second. There we go. Getting out of the inning. Going to the top of the ninth. Down to my final three ounce in this game. My flawless season on the line. We're only 1-0 to start the season. I've given up 17 hits. I only have five hits. But we're in danger of losing our perfect record on the season. Our opponent brings in Lee Smith. It's going to be 94 version. Four seam slider. Cut and fork ball. With our 3-4-5 hitters. Ken Griffey Jr. 99 version. Leading us off. Ken Griffey Jr. Crushes that one. Leading off the ninth inning with a warning. Track. Fly out. Dang. I thought we had a solo shot there. Shoot. Willie Mays to Tony Gwynn. Another deep ball. But that one's going to be caught for round number two. Mike Piazza hits it hard. Hits it up the middle. For a two-ounce base hit, I'm thinking it might be a little bit too little, too late. Down to my final out, down by six runs here. Tony Gwynn to Tony Gwynn, and we are losing the game. I've mentioned this before, and I kind of talked about it a little bit during this video. An issue that I still have is giving up a lot of foul balls, and after foul balls, giving a hittable pitch. So if my opponent like foul tips one or fouls it off and stays alive in the count, then I just it makes me more likely to make a mistake. And a lot of times I will and give up a hit, give up a home run, give up an extra base. So give up something that is definitely bad and leads to runs, leads to hits. I felt like I was seeing the ball pretty well. That nine up there, I think was my second batter of the game. I struck out my second batter of the game. I think that was my only strike on actually in the entire game. I kind of settled in, I would say, a little bit after the first inning. In the comment section below, do you guys think that check swings, like if you try to check your swing on a pitch, do you think that it should be called a strike like the hitter went around more often? I don't know. Just It seems like sometimes check swings are called for balls a little bit too often in my eyes. Let's go check what our rating went down by one and one to start the season. A little bit of a disappointing game for me. Gave up 17 hits, only had six, but I haven't been playing as much MLB. Maybe I'm a little rusty. We're losing 25 down to 652, pretty much where we started on the season. And I got to start winning some games quick. I got to play a lot of games. 
if we want to be getting to uh to world series and getting chipper jones i also need to get going on this program as well i've been slacking recently but like i said i've been sick and i just really haven't really felt like doing anything ever since i've been sick if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like subscribe comment anything down below feel free to follow on any of those social media some of the fortnite channel all that good stuff i'll see you next time thank you so much for watching hope you have a fantastic rest of your day peace out